Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Today is Wednesday, January 10th, and it is 8 a.m. I had a dentist appointment at seven o'clock this morning. It was very, very hard for me to get out of bed because I could not fall asleep last night. I am currently sitting here at the H-E-B. I'm about to run inside, grab a few things, and my camera is falling and then head home, do some work, and then I get to go back to the doctor at 12 and get a tooth fixed. And it's gonna be miserable, and I'm not excited. <gasps> Anyways, I'm gonna feel sorry for myself for a little while, but first we're gonna go into H-E-B, and H-E-B is gonna make me happy because H-E-B is just amazing. <laughs> Texas shaped cheese. I just went to the grocery store and grabbed a couple of things really quickly. I thought I would show you what I got. So I got these chopped up cauliflower collie bits. I really want to do something with the cauliflower and maybe mixing this beef together. It's 80-20 ground chuck. These are some La Tortilla Factory low carb tortillas. They're only three net carbs, eight grams of fiber. So, high in fiber, low in net carbs. I like to incorporate these every once in a while as kind of a treat. I currently can't have anything hot, so I picked up a Bang Energy drink to have some energy this morning because just since I had my teeth worked on, I can't drink anything hot for six hours. I got some hearts of romaine lettuce. I wanna start incorporating um, big salads into my meals every day. I got some of these mini Baby Bell cheeses. These are so good for like on the go or as a snack. Um, my friend got me onto these cheese. They're mozzarella and cheddar twisted string cheese. And they're just very delicious. I got some of these Hillshire Farm Little Smokies. These are cheddar and these are cheddar and jalapeno. There are only two carbs for five links. So I'll probably throw about 10 in a pan and like fry them up. And those will be really good. These like bring me back to my childhood because I used to eat these all the time as a kid. I got half of a pound of sliced pepperonis that I had them sliced thinly at the deli. I got this little ham because I wanted to fry up some ham for a meal because why not? And then I know I said that I like am not about eggs anymore, but this just looked really good. I was going to make it for breakfast for me and my dad because it's big and I'm not going to be able to eat for a while when I have my tooth worked on. So it's a spinach and mushroom breakfast kit. I won't talk about it now because I am going to make it. And last but certainly not least, I got a bag of pork rinds or chicharrones and that is today's little grocery haul. All right, I'm probably gonna wait another hour and a half or so to eat breakfast. But what I'm starting my day off with is, as y'all just saw, I just mixed up me some great bubblegum isominos from Man Sports. I'm just sipping on these this morning. This is a giant blender bottle. As you can see, it's as big as my head. What does it say? It's like 34 ounces or so. So if I can drink this before I go to the dentist, I am putting a good dent in some water for the day. As I just said, this is gonna be my caffeine this morning or one of these Bang Energy drinks. They're zero sugar, zero carbs, zero calories. Just giving me a little energy because I didn't sleep at all last night, barely. And I was up really early and, okay, so and so. And you know, this is the daily routine now, L-carnitine from Man Sports Rainbow Sherbet flavor and daily shot together. Since I very rarely drink, this is this is the extent of my drinking. Oh, that does not mix very well. 
with the the fluoride I have on my teeth. Oh. Nope, not about it. So this is what I'm going to make for breakfast. This is a spinach and mushroom breakfast starter. All you do is just add six eggs and salt and oil, it says. So I opened up this little package and it has some shredded spinach. Ooh, I'm throwing stuff on the floor. This has some shredded spinach in a bag as well as some cheese and tomatoes. Yes, I mean, there is carbs in those veggies, but not very many. You're not going to get fat on mushrooms. No, and, and mostly there's a lot of fiber in there, so it's kind of yeah. like, you know, those are what I call, you know, non-starchy carbs are pretty, Yeah. are not, are not going to give you a problem. Also in the container were some mushrooms, tri-colored bell peppers, onion, mm -hmm. and some green onion as well. You're supposed to start off by letting the mushrooms cook down a little bit. The only thing that sucks is that since they aren't separated, it was kind of hard to pick out just the mushrooms, but I did the best I could. Alright, this egg scramble is done. It's more veggies and I put sausage in there as well than eggs. So, hopefully this will taste good and this will hold me over for a couple of hours until I am done at the dentist. Alright, I am headed into my dentist appointment. I get a lot of anxiety about coming to the dentist. Even though she's one of our longtime friends, my mouth is very sensitive and like it's going to be painful. It was already painful this morning and my face is going to be numb. So the next time you see me, this, this side of my face probably isn't going to work. Hey guys, checking in. It took about two hours to do my teeth. Oh, it was not fun. Oh, I hate the dentist. I hate getting my teeth worked on. Covering half of my face because half of my face is numb. It's like... <laughs> Look at that smile. I have like... The stuff they put in my teeth all over my face. So, yeah. I'm home. They had to inject the like numbing stuff into my gums. And I'm slowly starting to like get that feeling back. Oh my golly. It hurts so, so bad. I can't eat for a while until my face is unnumb. So I'm going to go inside and work. And, I don't know, take some Advil so my face doesn't feel like it's going to fall off. Anyways, that's what's going on with me. Survive the dentist. Tomorrow I have yet another fun appointment where we get to test the nerves in my back. And have a needle stuck into my muscle. Uh... <laughs> It's a week of just misery for me. Absolute misery. Ugh. I want to go rinse out my mouth. Alright, I'm going to stop talking and rambling. Because I just feel weird. Oh yeah, also on the way home from the dentist, uh, there's a train across the tracks. Like always. So I had to go the long way around. And the long way around was where all the houses got flooded during Hurricane Harvey. And I haven't driven through there in probably a couple months. And it's still so, so, so sad just to see the devastation. And, I mean, there's still people's belongings along this side of the road. And everyone's living in trailers. And houses have been torn down. I'll insert a couple videos that I got when I just drove through for a couple of minutes.
it's sad guys it's so sad having a little treat a diet root beer <laughs> Checking in, it's about 5.30 now, and my mouth has gotten a numb. It's still hurting quite a bit though, but I am going to attempt to eat some pulled pork. Yeah, this looks really unappetizing, but they're like little nuggets of pork that shred when I like pull them apart. I'm munching on these, but I can only eat it on the right side of my mouth because the left side of my mouth hurts. I didn't eat a piece of my pulled pork and I look up and someone's eating it. Guess that's yours now, kitty. Hey, Bo, do you want a treat? Do you want a treat? Come here. Oh, do you want my last pulled pork that the cat ate? <laughs> can you sit? Oh, look at that face. Oh, ho, ho. I went to pull pork. So, with my mouth hurting, I have really just had no desire to eat like this afternoon. So, I had those couple bites of pulled pork, which really wasn't a lot. I'm glad I got some vegetables in with breakfast, some nutrition, because this just hurts. I don't really want to eat, I'm not hungry because it hurts. However, I did want to eat a little string cheese before I go to bed because my nighttime medicine kind of requires you to have food in your stomach. So I am going to eat myself one of these twisty string cheeses because I love them because they're just so twisty. Watch. All right, Ooh, I'm setting y'all on the counter and we're gonna show y'all the twistiness. See, you can pull it off and they're twisty. <laughs> Isn't that cool? It doesn't take much to amuse me. Quick little plug, because I know some of y'all have asked me about home workout tools. Mansports just announced these new adapter trainers for home workouts. So these are basically a gym in a bag. So what's super cool about these is you have these bands right here, and then you have ankle cables, a door stop and handles so with these bands you can basically get in a full workout at home as well as these bands that you can do many different things with and a jump rope so it's on sale right now and then you can stack that with my code KSalome. so if any of y'all are looking for a way to do some home workouts this is an awesome set to pick up hey guys I'm gonna go ahead and wrap this video up I've got two guest with me Bo in trouble as we close out this video I hope you enjoyed today's video sorry I didn't share a lot of eating just because I didn't want to eat anyways tomorrow is my last doctor's appointment hopefully I'll be back with another video so if you like this video please give it a big thumbs up or if you like Bo give him a thumbs up too I will see y'all tomorrow with another video bye guys Mwah. Blow everyone a kiss.